Here's the most counterintuitive piece, and it loops back to our everyday lives. The weight you feel right now, sitting or standing, is not gravity itself. It is the force the floor, chair, or ground exerts to prevent you from falling. Gravity is trying to make you accelerate downward at 1G. The floor continually pushes you upward just enough to cancel that motion. In a deep sense, you are already being accelerated upward by the ground at 1G all the time. Einstein's equivalence principle formalized this. Locally, you cannot distinguish between being in a rocket accelerating upward at 1G in empty space and standing on Earth in gravity as long as tidal effects are small. When a launch begins, the rocket doesn't introduce some alien kind of crushing force. It simply adds extra upward acceleration on top of the 1G you live with every day. 3G in a rocket is like tripling the effect of gravity temporarily. Because our bodies evolved under 1G and have significant safety margins, strong bones, adaptable circulation, and because engineers align and limit that extra acceleration, astronauts can endure that artificial gravity multiplier long enough to reach orbit. And when the engines finally shut down, the support force suddenly drops almost to zero, gravity is no longer being resisted, and they begin to fall freely around Earth. The G-force vanishes even as their speed peaks.